Well, George and Steph, the man told detectives that he was just trying to get new members to join the KKK with those, with those memos. And police say that was merely his statement, though, and they're passing on that statement and a longer interview to the state's attorney who is reviewing it tonight. You'll see in this photo, this is the person that police say acted alone and distributed two deliveries with two deliveries of those KKK flyers within a four block radius. You'll remember two women of color came forward about 10 days ago after finding those flyers left at their homes. And since then, there have been two large rallies. Investigators say the man believes what he did was lawful. He told police he identifies as a member of what's widely considered America's oldest hate group. We did ask him uh, direct questions about um, you know, the prevalence of the KKK in Vermont, specifically, specifically to Burlington, of course. Uh, and he indicated that, uh, to his knowledge, he was the only member from his faction of the KKK. Police say the focal point of the criminal charges they're expecting will be the apparent targeting of the two women who got the flyers. Burlington police say their investigation into the KKK letters has concluded, and after tips from the public, they're confident this is the only person that was involved. Police say they won't be releasing his name at this time, but again, they do expect some charges to be forthcoming. Live in Burlington tonight, Hannah McDonald, WPTZ News Channel 5.